Hey coach, so happy you found us on YouTube. A uh, couple things. First of all, make sure you go subscribe and like. That's really important. Second thing is make sure that you go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better. It's a one-stop shop for basketball coaches. It's the Hulu, Netflix, Amazon Prime, whatever you want. It's got a little bit of everything, but it's also got a community of like-minded coaches will help you become a better basketball coach. Go over and check it out. Let's head off to the video. In the middle. Great drill. Um, so Reggie's going to make a pass all the way through. Drew is going to defend. He's going to be an arm length away. Okay. So you're going to go here for a second so I can demonstrate. So when you make passes, you want to make passes. First of all, you want to close a window and then open a window. So there are four windows in which you want to pass a basketball. Window one, this ear right in here. Window two over here. Hip is three and the other hip is four. So usually I tell the players, break one window and then throw it through the other window. So if you break the ear window, then throw it through the hip. But never go through the window that you initially go. It's too easy to deflect. Um, so the object of this, very basic drill, but object is he is going to defend. He knows he's not going to dribble. He has to try to touch the ball. You do not want to be the man in the middle. This is bad. You don't want to be the middle child. Okay? So he is going to try to touch it. If Drew touches the ball with any, even his fingernail, then he gets the pass and Reggie would have to go in the middle. All right, ready? Go. Good, close the window. You gotta hold it for a five count. One, two. Good, you gotta let the defender get up. Yep, he's gotta anticipate. So let's say Drew touches it. So Ant makes it, oh, look at that, great steal. So then Anthony would go in the middle, he would defend, and Drew would have to again, Close it up. Now, if you, if you throw it over the head, even though I know some of the NBA guys do like this stuff and all over, if you throw it over the head, it's like him touching it. So this is a no man's land. We do not let him pass it over the head. Great warm up drill. Good. That's enough. So now you're in the middle. He touched it. Doesn't matter. If he touches it with anything, it's a deflection. You go in the middle. Um, Great warm-up drill. Take 35, 40 seconds, the beginning of practice, play man in the middle. It, it, it makes them focus. It, it is emphasizing the most important aspect of this game, which is defensive pressure, and they just stole the ball. So great drill, man in the middle, do it every practice. Hey coach, I'm glad you're liking the video. Hit like down below, that helps us a ton being found on YouTube. Subscribe, also hit the little bell up above if you wanna get notified. We put a new video up every day. We're breaking some of the great stuff down right now. Also go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who wanna get better.